I'm part of the uh, non-governmental organization that's called the Argentine Forensic Anthropology Team that basically apply forensic sciences, mostly forensic anthropology, archaeology, and genetics to the investigation of human rights violations. Uh, we started working in 1984 when democracy returned to Argentina to try to find the remains of the people who disappeared during the previous military government. It's such an honor, it's such an important award that uh, it, it will benefit our organization in terms of providing more legitimacy to what we do um, and to the application of forensic sciences in general on the, the human rights field. I also think that uh, it is, um, in a way it also supports the struggle of the families of victims of the disappeared that are requesting forensic services and independent investigations to know what happened with their loved ones and to find justice and to find their remains. So I think it, by giving this award, I think it's, it, it goes both to forensic people doing this work and families of, of disappeared people that are uh, looking for their loved ones. Within the next 10 years, we would really like to see that independent investigations, independent forensic investigations on human rights cases are not going to be any more disputable issues and are going to be more acceptable. We think that uh, because the MacArthur Fellowship is such a prestigious uh, award, um, that will bring more forward people from the scientific community and uh, other officials eventually in the countries where we go to accept more, to work on these areas.